Hi students, today we're going to be making buttery soft pretzels. This recipe is modified a little bit to fit our whole community, but we're going to be giving you the original recipe at the end of the show to fit your own family. These are the basic ingredients. We have 15 cups of sifted flour, one tablespoon of salt, one cup of sugar, four cups of warm water, a tablespoon of yeast, mixed with one teaspoon of sugar, and three tablespoons of vegetable oil. Let's get started. The first thing you need to do is mix all your dry ingredients. So we have our 15 cups of sifted flour, and we're going to mix in our sugar and our salt. Okay, it's just a quick mix. Once this is done, you need to take your warm water and add your yeast and sugar mix. Just give it a little whisk and let it sit for one to two minutes. While you're waiting for your yeast to set, you can get a pot ready that your dough will rise in. You need to give it a quick spray and a dusting of flour. So now that our yeast is ready, we're going to take our dry ingredients and make a well in the center. Then we're going to add our oil to the yeast and add this to our dry ingredients. A lot of times it might end up being a little crumbly and you'll have to add extra water. But adding too much water can be dangerous. You just want it so that it is a soft dough, but not too moist. So once it's mixed enough for you to form it into one big ball, you're just going to take it out and turn it out onto the counter. And you're just gonna work at it and knead it until it's smooth. Once it's pretty smooth, you're going to take it and put it in your pot to rise and take a clean cloth, just lay it over the pot and put it in a warm place to rise for about an hour to an hour and a half. While waiting for the dough to rise, you want to get your baking sheets ready. Um, I use parchment paper, but I also have to spray it and give it a light dusting of flour. Once the dough is risen, you need to punch it down and turn it out onto a lightly floured counter. Then you need to divide it into equal parts. Each one will end up weighing about a quarter of a pound. Each one of these I'm going to divide into equal parts. Now we're going to shape our pretzels. The first thing you need to do is to roll each piece out into a long rope, about two feet long. Bring it over to the baking sheet, fold it in half, take your two ends, give them a full twist, bring them down, and just reshape it. The next step is our water bath. You're going to need about 10 cups of boiling water. And you're going to add about a cup of baking soda. And you're going to take your pretzel and place it in the water bath for about 10 to 15 seconds. We're going to make an egg wash. So you just crack one egg, whisk it up. brush on the pretzels just to give it a nice color. Next we're going to sprinkle each one of them with sea salt. Put it in the oven and set the timer for three minutes. When the timer goes off, you have to flip the tray around.
leave them in until they're golden brown. And that's how we make pretzels here at the monastery. So have fun making them in your own home.